no place I'd rather be than in his presence. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Point at the chair where you're sitting next to. It will be. It will be. I said it will be. Hallelujah. And I'm not talking just for have somebody to count, but somebody that's been broken, somebody that's a prodigal, somebody that don't know anything about this truth, but that seed you're sitting next to right now, it will be filled. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. My, my, my. Glory, glory. I like what I feel. Amen. And if you don't feel what I feel, there's something wrong with your feeling. Hallelujah, hallelujah. The Holy Ghost is in the house tonight. Amen. I said the Holy Ghost is in the house tonight. I don't know about you, but I didn't come to look at you. I didn't come to be seen. But I came to worship the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. So if somebody gets out of the ordinary on Wednesday night, don't look at them like they're crazy. Because you don't know where they've been. You don't know what they've been through. You don't know where God brought them from. So if somebody begins to act a little out of the ordinary, just know that God has been good to them. And can you say today that God has been good to me? God has been good to me. I've got a reason to shout. I've got a reason to lift my voice. I've got a reason to praise Him. That one day, Sister Lou, he walked down into the pit. He walked down into the fiery clay where I was, and he picked me up. I've got a reason to give praise to him. I've got a reason to give glory to him tonight, even on a Wednesday night. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise the Lord. You don't know like I know what he's done for me. Oh, I can tell you my testimony. You all know that. And you know many others. But you wasn't in my shoes. You wasn't in my shoes the day that I was on my way going to a devil's hell. But one day he reached down. Oh, you walked away from me, son. But I'm giving you a chance to come back. I'm going to wake you up. And I'm going to welcome you back into the fold. He did so good to me. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I'm not supposed to preach tonight. But he's here. Amen. Yes, here. Praise the Lord. They have one more song they're going to sing. And, uh, and then we're going to turn this pulpit over to Brother Phillips and let him preach to us tonight. Amen. Are you excited for the word? Even if it steps on your toes? Sometimes we need our toes to be stepped on to put us back on the right path, amen, and to wake us up, amen. Praise the Lord, amen. If you can, if you stand one more time with this song, let's just worship God. Let's, let's keep this presence moving. Let's keep it stirring, amen. There's something about when you come to church and the atmosphere of praise and the atmosphere of worship is here. It just sets for the whole the whole service, amen. Whether it's an hour long, whether it's two hours long, amen. There's just something about the presence of God when you walk into it and you lift your holy hands up. Worship with them as they sing tonight. 